Oh. That's nice. Oh, he ain't stopping. I'm not gaining any line yet. He hit it once when I wasn't looking. And he came back to finish her up. Good morning, River Rats. Welcome to my tent house. There's the right side, there's the left side, and that's pretty much it. I got a few errands to run, then we got some fish to catch. Let's go. How do I look? Like I just saw a ghost? I don't really care as long as I don't get sunburned. That'll do. Let's get some warm up fish in the boat. We'll get the little guys out. Maybe get some stripers. Plus the little guys are on top anyway, so saves me some untangling. I gotta rig them up anyway. Oh, I forgot to take the bait off this one. Gross. It's a pretty standard move on my part. I guess it'll be easy to cast it back out. How sweet would it be if uh, this gets hit before I have the rest of them back out? It's possible. There's a there's a lot of fish down there, I think. There's a lot of rock. Looked like good fish though. Give me some of them stripers. Light tackle stripers. Seems like for every one striper I get five blue cats. Which is okay too. She down. Much different day than yesterday. This was the one of the rigs that went through hell and back. Guess they all did really in their own unique and interesting way. What do we have in here? I got a one, two, two good shad boys and sucker tail. And then I got those other shad that I want to take to take back with me. Get this sucker tail out. Cut a few strips off of him. Definitely got out here much later than I wanted to. Been trying to uh, get some videos uploaded. Internet hasn't been the easiest. Watch me hook like a 40 pounder on one of these little rods with the little baits. It does work that way sometimes. We'll figure it out. That I promise you. This wind's got me all cack eyed. Just swaying. Swaying's hard on a guy. Oh, my nose is running. Hopefully, there's a little bit of a midday bite. We're gonna find out. Marked a pile of fish behind that bridge pylon, too, so that's an option if this doesn't produce anything. So many options, endless options. Well, I just had one. Better check this bait. Partially to make sure I have it and partially to see what it was because I don't remember. Might be... Huh, it's that chunk of shad that I threw out first. wonder why I didn't get hooked. They all got sucker except for that one and that's the only one that got hit so far. Gonna pay attention to that, but I'll give these sucker chunks. Ooh. There we go. That's not a small fish. Should probably reel in this line. So we don't have a replay of yesterday. I'm kind of just trying to coax him to the boat. Holy cow. I got it in. And he's almost here. That did not take very long, which is what I like to see. Man, he just floored it too. Ooh. Heavy fish. Ooh, he's running down. Whoa. Yep, we're gonna double. <laughs> I think we are picking off where we left off yesterday. Now I'm really glad I reeled that other line in. It's 
Stay on here, buddy. This is a maze of ridiculousness. Yeah, he's like running up river. This one ain't giving up. Wow, this one's pretty, this is a pretty big fish. Did this one pop off? Nope. That one's just hanging out. Tell you what, my back was hurting this morning. This is kind of loosening it up a little bit, which is nice. There's no give up in this one. <laughs> this is a really big fish. Good thing my net's actually ready. Oh yeah, nice blue. I marked some, oh no. <laughs> oh, that was almost really bad. Just about lost a fishing rod there. Okay, well, uh, I think we effectively tired this guy out. All right, come here. Got him unrolled. Had him unrolled for a brief moment. Okay, yep, swim under, and then you'll pop up, and I'll net you. Sound good? Yeah. Yes, okay, got one, it's a nice, that's a really nice blue. <sighs> okay. Oh yeah, I got this fish on. I don't think he's gonna be quite as big. He wants to go in that bucket though. Kinda the way he fought, kinda acted like a striper, except he's not, he's a smaller blue cat. Pandemonium. So these guys both don't mind sucker. I can flip you, man. What a cute little tyke. He is a little tight compared to that other one. Had some uh, minor technical difficulties with the cameras. Ugh. This is like a, I don't know, almost like father-son combo. But uh, doubles are a great way to start the morning off, especially on the, uh, the light rods. Yeah, the catfish down here are mean. He's a dark one. He's fat too. They're all fat. It's blue cat we're talking about. All right, uh, let him go and try to do this again. Because it's fun. Ugh. And fun is good for you. See ya. Back to the depths. Need uh, my towel. Oh, my back. My back. Suppose I'll toss that chunk back out there. Hopefully, do her again. Just total non-stop action, for real. Like, even today's marginal weather. It's better than yesterday. Well, kinda, it's like bluebird skies, not catfishing weather. But here we are, catching cats, two at a time. About to get another one, I think. Oh, it's caught in a, a leaf. I think I still am. Oh yeah, you got me a nice leaf. Not the biggest one floating around out there, but you know, not a bad one. So yeah, between the wind and the current, this is where the leaves congregate. But also the fish lots of times, which is why we're parked right here. Is he a short biter? No, he's on there. He pulled it down and then stopped and came back. Say he's not small, but they all feel big on here. No big run. This was, uh, was this the one I just casted out? I don't remember. 
I'm gonna keep fishing here until I get less bites than every 10 to 20 minutes and then I'm gonna try in the current a little bit more where I was last night. Blue, he just cartwheeling. Spiraling, yeah, that's not a cartwheel. Cause he's wrapped up in it like they so often do. Hey, you can unwrap? You unwrap for the moment anyway. <coughs> Might be able to lift him in by the leader. I'm gonna try. Maybe in a sec. He got tired of doing his little spinny mabob. It's like I'll fight now. I'm fighting he is. Yeah, he's nice. Oh no, he just came off. Easy release. That was fun. Got the best part. Oh, got another one. I was getting it's the one I just tossed out. Fresh bait, float rig. Might be on something. On to some little, little blue cats. Hey, that'll work. Sweet. It's always just nice to be catching something. Might keep a few later. I haven't made up my mind yet. I was just getting ready to uh, reel lines into move and that one got smacked for a hot minute. Somehow missed the hook. This one's stuck in some cabbage. Then we're gonna go and try a little more current. Things have slowed down here substantially. And that one that got poked, I'm gonna reel that one in last. Hey, it came out. How convenient. Right at the boat. Moving. Not far. Like 50 yards. Okay, we're down and uh oh, never fished before. We're in a little bit more current. I can still cast on that edge though. That's what I'm really wanting. And get bait on one more and we're good. And we have a good one. Tangled in another line already. I literally just uh, tried to, uh, I had to change batteries. Try and coax him up. Or he might be coaxing himself up. That would be ideal. Yeah, one little move and here we are. Just gonna keep some pressure on him. Maybe he'll run at me. There's just enough current where it's gonna make landing fish difficult. I pull on him and he doesn't move a lot. I wonder if he's like that other good one. There he's diving down a little bit. Now he's coming back up, going back down. What are you gonna do here? I am still kind of impressed by how hard he hit it. I never saw it. I just heard the drag peeling, which was nice. Oh, there he is. Oh yeah, a big fat blue. Dive down, swim over here. Might just have to uh, point and reel at him. These guys are so much fun on these light spinning outfits. Yep, swim at me. He thought about it, he's just too tired. <laughs> these are lighter outfits, but I still run like 30 pound braid, 20 pound leader for situations just like this. And if I hooked one like that bigger one in this current, we'd be in for an absolute monster of a fight. Oh no, stay out of that rope. Getting close. Oh yeah. 
I think he is ours. Nope. Maybe. The landing float pod. Got him. That's where another one goes down. Got me uh, another little pudge ball. And he uh, crushed it. Got leeches all over his face. At least on this side. Right there. Little ones. I guess everybody's got to eat. Including me, but I'm not going to eat you. All right, see ya. That was instant. On that chunk of sucker. In the rattle. Sometimes those rattles do seem to make a difference. Oh, he pooped all over me. Get this one back out and get my hands cleaned up. Gross. It took him a minute. Wow, he kind of acting stripery, honestly. Yep, that's a little more stripery, especially how it took him a minute to get it down the hatch. Is this the one way downtown? I can move him a little bit. Well, this is not a tiny one. Let's see, what lines is he in? He's in that one. See, under it. He's gonna run this way, then he's gonna run all the way the other way, probably. If it's a striper. What is this thing? These are the long ways out there yet. I'm not sure. I might have too many lines out. Yeah, he's definitely toting that rig around. So we're gonna save this one. Well, it's got grass on it anyway, so it's a good excuse to get it in. I wasn't impressed by the initial bite, like you had to work to get it down the hatch, but I'm impressed by the fight. What are you? Ooh, that was nice. It's staying down. Which makes me think it's not a blue, or it's a really big blue. How cool would it be if it was a flathead? Honestly, my arm is kind of tired. I'm just gonna keep her tight. Reel them in from a long ways. This is a striper. This is a really nice striper. It's a nice fish either way. The mystery is part of the fun. Oh yeah, it's a striper. Sweet. Oh yeah, he's tangled in that other line. Not too bad though. I can live with that. Okay, stay on there, buddy. He's not hooked especially well. Yeah, yeah, he is. Hey, hey! Man, they fight so good. Yeah, when I saw him just go, dip, 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 like he was gnawing on it, like stripers like to. Um, I figured it was a striper, and then it stayed down and didn't come up to the top and roll around. And you can get them catfishing, basically. That's literally the reason I'm using the small spinning rods to make that more fun. Love you, striped fish. Also love how you don't kill them all when it's cold out. Like if it's hot, you almost better off just eating every one of them. Well, initially I didn't think the tangle was too bad. Maybe it wasn't initially. Okay. Quite a bit of progress there. Yep. If I could get some live shad, like some small thread fins, it'd be game over. Still decent bait, toss that one back out. Get back to fishing. Oh, that's nice. 
Well, try to save this one before we run into issues. No, he ain't stopping. I'm not gaining any line yet. He hit it once when I wasn't looking. And he came back to finish her up. This is acting, I don't know. Nice. It's up on top though. Which is not good in this current. Ooh. Stay over on this side. It's not real easy to move. And I'm not sure if he's throwing me head shakes or if he's just rolling up in it. It's a lot of unknowns right now. There we go. Man, he's fighting like a champ. Are you gonna be a netter? Another one coming in from a long ways away. Well, when you cast him out a long ways, it makes the fight better. Well, longer. <laughs> Still haven't seen him yet. He's staying down again. Oh, shoot. It's on the rod holder. Wow. Whatever you are, again, fighting like a boss. Oh, I saw him. Oh, nice blue. Honestly, I almost can't believe I got him in this far. This easy. Like he didn't just come up to the top and start rolling around. Well, uh... I'll just net him, I think. I just feel like I'm walking my fish. Okay, get the net ready. He is ours, I think. Yep. Hook's tangled in the net. It's all right. Because we got him. Oh, no. Nice one. That's fun. Little little head, plump body, lots of fun. Well, another rod folded. Feels like a blue cat just freaking out. Well, there he is, a little blue cat. It's just total non-stop action, really. Ugh. Oh, that was a good burp. Come here. Okay. Not too shabby. Cute little tyke. Fun. All right, let's go catch some shad. Oh, my back. Let's see if I'm gonna roast a net. There was a whole bunch of gar in here, but I think there was some shad too. There's stuff. It'd be sweet to see my net swimming away with gizzard shad in it. Well, there's something kicking. Something big. Big old gar probably. Yep, two of them. Immediate regret, abort, get out of there. Got one out. At least one was easy. Don't destroy my net, please. Okay. Just give it up, man. Just give it up. Wow. That was relatively pain-free. See if we can punish ourselves some more. There's tons of stuff in here. My concern is it's tons of gar. But I'll take a few gar if there's like gizzards mixed in with it. I don't know. I'm gonna find out. I'm scared. I don't feel any kicking yet. Uh, there's at least one gar. Get out of there. Yes. Well, I'd all but given up hope. Hope restored. So I saw him like 20 feet to the left, so I threw 20-ish 20, 20 feet to the left and got him. Just like you draw it up. Well, now they're 25 feet to the left. I don't know if I got him there or not. Oh, 
Maybe the camera isn't bad luck. I got a displaced crappie too. Fortunately, can't keep the crappie. Well, they are wonderful bait. Sweet. Yeah, you would be good bait. So tempting. Let's go look for a different school. One that we haven't picked on. But we will be tossing big baits. Sweet. Well, for the amount of time we have, I think we're good. Let's go try to catch a big fish. Well, we are at what at this point I would call my favorite spot. Pulling out all the stops, going six rods. Mainly because I have enough bait and I can. We're gonna hit this one other spot, then we might even go back to the dam. We'll see. So many options. I would say I should have got my butt out of bed earlier, but that wasn't even the issue. It's just like all the other stuff I just ooh, that'll call in. All the other stuff I have to get done. Sinkers, check, and then we can get four of them baited. I think we'll uh, just put him out almost whole. Okay, that's a dandy of a bait. Big baits, long weights, about 20 minutes. Just had a nib, looked promising. Then I realized it was probably a gar. Next spot, we'll see what happens. Allegedly, there's some nice fish here. This one's 100 foot back. Use the drift sock and probably double anchor it. Wind swirling around just enough to be a pain. Might rotate them in. Do the old rotator roo. That one's a hundred. Seventy. Ninety. Oh, it's getting nibbed already. Just a nib though. It's encouraging. That's that giant bait. I think. Yeah. No, it's not the giant giant one. It's a good sized one. At least not the most discouraging sign I've ever seen. Ooh, take it down, buddy. Oh, thought you had it. Believed in you. When nobody else believed in you, you let me down. That's not a bad fish. Oh, that was nice to see that fold over. I wonder if it was the one who hit it earlier. Oh, and I was already thinking about my next spot. Yeah, he's heavy. Yeah, he might be in that other line. Did he swim over it? That would be pretty convenient. Well, it's gonna be the best way to land you, dude. We'll evaluate based on size. We'll be able to flip him. Not bad, not a monster, but not bad. He might have ate a big bait, actually. If it's a 10 out, we'll know. He's not really hooked, like the hook's in the corner. But... Not so bad. It wasn't on the mega shad, but it was on half a shad. He's not a mega sized blue cat, but he's pretty fun, especially in that current. That was sweet. So thanks for playing, dude. A lot better than yesterday. I'm going to let him go. I think I'll give this spot like another 15 minutes and then moving on. Unless they keep biting, which should be all right. Au revoir, friend. More bait. I always need more bait. Well, this one got bit. 
during the crazy sway of 92. I don't know if he's still on there. Doesn't appear so. Toss her back out, I guess. Hopefully he comes back. 10 minute warning. You know, I'd be happy if any of these rods go down, but that one, that one might snap. <laughs> Just at the funny angle. If a big dog tees it up hard, should probably back my drag off. We'll let her ride, see what happens. I was gonna give it three more minutes, but I think I've seen enough. Let's hit the road. Target acquired. Let's see if anybody's home. Just never know what's down in places like this. It's kind of part of the intrigue, honestly. Or at least to me. All right. Okay, on the bottom. It's good. It's a good place for an anchor. As long as it doesn't stay there permanently, I guess. Feel like a giant kite out here. Kinda. Okay, just add bait. Gonna have to downsize them just a smidge because I um, forgot how to count. Oh yeah, I do have another big dog hanging down there. Like I said, forgot how to count. I'm gonna put him out hole after all. All right. Let's get a big dog bait out there. Hopefully something just folds this one. Let's get another big bait out there. Catfishing is such an icky sport. If you want to call it a sport, I guess. We are right on the edge of that current. Not a terrible place to be. Got some baits in fast water, got some baits in slow water. They're all in rock though, I promise you that. Well, here we are for the long haul. I haven't soaked strictly big baits here yet. So, we'll see what happens. I will probably do little moves though, like Probably spend about a half hour here and then maybe move. Oh, I got a tap. Might move further over. It's a lot of little fish here. I don't know if there's any big dogs, but we'll see. Just messing on my phone. That was on that big, big, big bait. Probably should have put two hooks in that one. I will. I'd cry about that one a little bit more, but even if I would have been Johnny on the spot, I don't know what I would have done different. I mean, it was flat lined. He'd had it pinned, reeled down. My bet is he never had the hook in his mouth. So he got a free meal. Good for you, bud. He's not tiny, tiny. I had my buddy Chris on the line. Chris, I think you're good luck. Okay. Bye. All right, bye. All right. He's, is he coming in like sideways or something? He didn't destroy it. Yeah. He's just a little tyke. Chris was calling to say, hey, you should keep some. Okay. That's definitely an eater. Not the fish you expect on baits like that, but they're gluttonous. That's why I was pulling hard. It's because uh, he was wrapped up in it. Ow. He was wrapped up because of uh, that right there. Turned himself into a good old propeller. I'm impressed you got the hook, dude. You're just angry. Yeah, that's like a perfect eater. 
replace one of those and toss them back out. Leave that head chunk on, I think. Oh. Alright, so I put this little rod out so I could get us an eater. There's so many small blues out here. It's ridiculous. Fighting them off the front of the boat's tough. Oh, perfect eater. Have you just wanted a fish fry? Holy cow. The big ones are tougher, but one of these guys. Try to get one more and uh, call the keeping good after that. Oh, hey. Are you actually... I think he just rolled up in it and popped off. Huh. What's the deal? Well, just had the old spinning rod take a nose dive. I'm gonna bet this is a striper. Just the way it's running out, around, here, there, everywhere. It took off on one heck of a run. Oh yeah, striper. Is he gonna be legal? I think so. Oh, it's a hybrid. You'll work too. Stay on. In the boat. No! Pop the line. That was a good striper. Or wipe. Hybrid. <laughs> Dinner. Gone. Well. Oh well. Lose, lose one, you rig one. Actually, I'm not going to rig one. I already have one rigged. <laughs> Swap them out. Try this again. Well, River Rats, this is going to do it for me. I'm going to try and catch one more eater and probably head in. We might be pecking on it right now. But uh, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit the like button. If you want to see more like it, hit the subscribe button. I don't know. It was a fun couple days on the water. And I feel pretty dang blessed that I get to, you know, enjoy this type of stuff. Let me know what you want to see in the comments. If you want to check out my podcast, that'd be cool. But either way, thanks for watching. Hope you catch a giant.